I've actually um, run the 10 marathons in 10 days before, five years ago. Never really imagined I'd come back. Um, some people were a little surprised at the end when I revealed that the reason I had gone for it um, was to run through the menopause. Um, I think I'm now beyond that and I'm, this time I want to celebrate my 60th birthday. I'm going to be 60 on the day before the first of the 10 marathons so for me it will definitely be a, a dry birthday without too much of a party although I've, I'm sure the, the people here at Braithe will help me celebrate in some way or other. Um, to those who, who don't run it may seem a bit crazy and a bit daunting to think about running this sort of distance but I started only 10-15 years ago from not running, not even run, wanting to run for a bus. Um, I got free health club membership if I agreed to run a, a marathon for charity. Um, so that's how it all started with me rather by accident. And um, I envisaged that I would actually fast walk the London Marathon because I couldn't run. But I got really hooked on the, the training programme. I enjoyed the feeling of achievement that I got from um, training for the marathons and I broke into a jog and, and I did it in under four and a half hours which slightly surprised some people that sponsored me who agreed to double it if I did it in under, under four and a half hours. Um, my business at, um, that I actually I suppose I, I was inspired to start after I ran the last 10 in 10. Um, the 10 in 10 I think gave me the confidence to actually go out and retrain to be a, a fitness trainer. Um, my business, Fit for Age, works specifically with um, people over the age of 50. Although I have most of my clients are actually in their 70s, 80s, and I have two clients in their 90s. Um, what I find with them is they're, they're very often nervous about going to a gym or certainly wouldn't think about going to a running club to start running. Yeah, once people pluck up the courage in many cases to actually start exercising when they're um, a little older. Um, it doesn't take long, I don't find, to, to get the confidence that they can actually do more than they think they can do. And um, from somebody that might have said to me, oh I could never run, um, they do end up actually starting to, to do just that. But it doesn't have to be running. I, my feeling is that uh, we should all do an exercise that we enjoy. It just so happens that I have come to really enjoy running. Um, but it, it needn't be that, and uh, it can be dancing, swimming, cycling, whatever, whatever takes your fancy.